I'm going to take you on a really interesting journey. You're actually going to get a really bird's eye view of the island and exactly the magic that we've created there over the last five years. So as I mentioned, David had had this epiphany at this conference and had th said, health is the biggest luxury, the greatest luxury in your life. So he went back to Wakaya and he started thinking about what he could do to make this collection so powerful and so healing and so shareable. So he um, went actually back to a very special memory. His mother was a very famous opera singer. And at the age of five or six, he always remembered that she would actually have ginger tea before she sang. So he associated the smell of ginger with the beautiful songs that his mother would sing. So ginger became very, very special to him. So he traveled back to Wakaya and he started with ginger. Now, at, we all know the benefits of ginger. They're all over the news. They're all over over the internet, you can Google, you'll find a ton of listings of just how powerful it is. It's over 4,000 years old, so this is not new. This is absolutely one of the most powerful healers we have. If you have a cold or a flu symptom, it's an excellent healer for that. When you get sick, your mother or your st stomach's upset, your mother always says what? Drink ginger ale. There's a reason. Um, fishermen in the open seas use chew on raw ginger to quell their nausea. It's also a metabolic booster, so it has an incredible range of benefits. But what, Den or Dennis, what David did, David, as with Fiji water, did something completely different. So he took a very rare organic pink Fijian ginger seed, and he went through the Fijian islands and crossbred that seed with a number of different strains to create his own Wakaya Perfection organic organic pink Fijian ginger. He did that completely to be different. You cannot find the seed anywhere. The root nor the seed never leave the island. On top of that, if you remember, we have that seven million year old virgin volcanic soil. We took that beautiful seed, planted it in our gorgeous brown sienna soil. This doesn't even do it justice. It's actually so beautiful and rich. And we have our farmers that actually tend to it. They plant everything by hand. If you remember the video that you saw, you saw there on these 45 degree hillsides. We don't even have an irrigation system on Wakaya. It's natural Fijian rainfall that nourishes the crops. Very, very thoughtful cultivation. This is one of my favorite slides. The reason being is that most ginger is grown in China and in India, and it's only grown on flatlands. Two things happen when you grow ginger and even turmeric on flatlands. If there's any type of flooding or any type of storm, the, um, on the flatlands, the water runs off and it runs into the soil and it rots the root. So you have root rot and you lose your crops immediately. The second thing, and this always makes me laugh when people say, I only like fresh ginger. Second things that happen anytime there's a flood, sewage and waste automatically go into the soil and you're cultivating fresh ginger in contaminated soil for decades. So what we do on Wakaya, if you see this little red mark up here, this is our first ginger paddock on Wakaya in this interior shot of the island. We grow our ginger on 45 degree hillsides. That helps us retain the, the uh, the, sorry, retain the soil pristine nature, the integrity of the crops. The Fijian rain, rainfall nourishes the crops, so we don't have to worry about that root rot, and we don't compromise the product. We also do this because, as you've probably heard, uh, there's a lot of cyclones in Fiji. When the last cyclone hit, the main island lost 85% of their crops. Wakaya lost 1%. So this is a cyclone way, cyclone proof way of cultivating. Very important slide. As I mentioned, we grow all of our ginger in a paddock, and you'll see it's surrounded by a fence. This is, again, in the thoughtful lane, vein. This is a electromagnetic fence. So any of our animals on the island that comes close, it doesn't shock them. It just sends out a vibration warning to them. So again, very thoughtful. What we do is we take each harvest. We harvest one time a year. We take it, we harvest our ginger, we move our paddock to a new paddock, and we let the old one rest. We call it lie and fallow. And we do that because we want that gorgeous soil to re-energize, and we want that virgin vol volcanic rock to break down and release those nutrients into the soil. And what we get is 
an absolutely beautiful ginger root. When we first pulled this out of the ground, we were so astounded. It came out as fragrant as you'll smell on our in our samples back there, as pink as our Fijian sunsets. It's absolutely beautiful. You'll never see this kind of root at the market. So it's a very powerful, pure, completely proprietary product only grown on Wakaya. We have a small factory on Wakaya. What we do is we take that root that you just saw, we shave it into potato chip slices, and we bake it in a convection oven for 22 hours. And we bake it at 76 degrees. And the reason we do that is ginger is normally flash dried at 220 degrees. And if a lot of you like to cook out there, you'll know when you make vegetables and you cook them too long, what happens? You lose the vitamins. So we cook it longer, we extract that moisture, and after that we actually grind it into that luxurious rose gold powder that you see. So during that process, we're able to not only protect the flavor, but protect the healing agents, which are called gingerols, within the ginger. So you're getting the delicious flavor and the power of the product. We kind of stumbled upon turmeric in a beautiful way and had a very thoughtful idea. So everybody's been hearing about turmeric. Dr. Oz calls it the golden spice of life. Uh, if you have anyone that has arthritic pain, any type of inflammation, this is the product for it has incredible benefits, everything from purifying your liver and your blood. It's an antioxidant. It is very powerful. And what we did was, we were cultivating our ginger and we don't use pesticides. So we thought, what could protect our ginger? We realized that turmeric is a natural antioxidant. So we thought, let's thoughtful way of cultivating. Let's try and plant our ginger and turmeric together in the same paddock every other row. And it was one of the best things that we ever did. They grew beautifully in harmony together. They protected each other. Again, a very way, thoughtful way of cultivating. And when we actually brought it to harvest, we were astounded. And I encourage everyone, when you get your turmeric, to smell it. It's absolutely beautiful. Not only is this, again, proprietary and completely rare and pure, especially by the way we cultivate, our turmeric has five times more healing power than any turmeric powder out there. It, it, yeah, it owns a, or it, it actually contains curcumin, which is the healing agent, five times more powerful. So you know that whether you're taking our caplets or you're enjoying our powder, you're getting that quality, quality product. We then naturally looked to the beautiful Fijian Ocean, our reefs around Wakaya, and we created sea salt. And we did that because sea salt is critical to our existence. There's so many benefits. If you sleep with sea salt on your pillow and you have allergies, it helps reduce allergy symptoms. A lot of you may hear about some spas popping up, specifically in Florida, that are for asthmatics. You walk into a room, there's about a foot of salt in the room, you sit for an hour, and your asthma actually is relieved. So we went off a few of our beaches, our 32 beaches, and we actually desalinate straight from our beach. So we draw this gorgeous apple jade um, ocean water out, we desalinate it, and we extract our high saline content. Now, as part of that process, we all know about the village on Wakaya, we get potable drinking water. That goes for our, our staff and, to, and their families to drink. We then dry the... Um, the salt in solar beds on our beaches for seven days. So they get to sunbathe for seven days, and what you get is this absolutely be beautiful, pure, pink, uh, sorry, beautiful, pure Fijian kosher sea salt. Now, another interesting fact, sea salt normally has 330 milligrams of salt, of sodium. We have actually 310, so it's a low sodium sea salt. Uh, everything that grows on Wakaya grows in a very unique way. This is one of my favorite. Um, a lot of you probably have not heard of Dilo oil. It's very rare. It's indigenous to the South Pacific specifically. It is an incredible healer. When babies are born in Fiji, they are swaddled in Dilo oil. Back in the day, we spoke of Tui Wakaya on Wakaya, the chieftain. Chieftains were the only ones allowed to use this on their skin because it had anti-aging properties, so they were allowed to look young. It has a natural SPF built into it by Mother Nature. It is incredible incredibly hydrating. If you look at the South Pacific and the Fijian skin is absolutely amazing. But when you see how we cultivate it, you will understand why it is so precious and rare. This is our beach. It's called Nautilus Beach. It's actually hit hard by the most waves on Wakaya. Um, all along the beach, as you'll see here, are dilo trees and the dilo bears of fruit. 
The fruit is about the size of a grapefruit. It's very hard. And we can't control this harvesting. Mother Nature is in full charge of this up until about 2%, which we take over at the end. We have to wait till she drops this to the sand. Once she does, it'll either lay on a piece of driftwood or on the sand. It's very, very hard. Now, we have to go back to this beach every single week because as you see with these nuts, you'll see the green ones are brand new, the pruny ones are starting to transition, and the kind of yellowish ones go into nut form. So once they start to dry, they almost get like a mushy avocado, and that's just the exterior. But the best part, and I really didn't understand it or believe it until I actually went to Wakaya and saw it, at dawn and dusk, we have our Fijian sand crabs come out of the ocean, go run up the beach, they actually eat the exterior mushy part of the rind of the dilo fruit for their own nourishment. So again, very, very thoughtful. I really did not believe it until I sat and saw it. <laughs> Um, it's a really, they actually help us incredibly. Once they eat that rind, you'll see it turns into a nut. It's very, very hard. And within that nut, we either crack them open or they naturally crack, is a kernel, that little white part. Now we can finally take over the cultivation. We gather all the kernels. We actually cold press them all by hand. And we extract a gorgeous emerald green precious 100% organic Dilo oil. And we've put this Dilo oil in many of our spa and beauty products because it is so powerful. But uh, it, is, it is going to be very, very popular. I can guarantee you're all going to love it. Uh, we also are really excited to introduce essential oils. This is, this is another beautiful part of our product offering. Uh, essential oils, our, our sense of smell is one of those senses. It's actually the most sensitive we have. And it's it's the one that evokes memories very easily. If you, all, if you all have children and you pick up a crayon and you smell it, you know, just brought back to when you were young. It does everything with aid with headaches. I, if you smell eucalyptus, it will help with your headache. If you smell lavender, it will help you relax. So a lot of the essential oils we choose, we're very selective with, um, and they do have a powerful influence on how you feel. So we actually um, use a lot of different focuses when we're looking at our oils. Oils, essential oils are actually essences extracted from various plants. It can be bark, it can be fruit, they can be extracted from floral, leaves, anything. They really are the liquid essences of these plant lives. And essential oils have been around for a very long time. They were actually around long before medicine and they were made into healing elixirs and blended. And 100% natural way for people to feel better when there was no medicine. So what we're doing is we are working with the best artisans around the world to introduce quality, pure, therapeutic grade oils, essential oils. It's critical that we have that level of purity. It, excuse me, falls right in line with Wakaya's vision. We're very excited about that. And for us, as I mentioned, purity is essential with everything we do at Wakaya Perfection. I'm excited to introduce the collections to you, and hopefully you've had some time to look at some of the samples around the room. But uh, we have different ways that you can enjoy these products. And like I said, these are going to be very, very easy for you to share with your network. There's so many different ways to enjoy them. We have our culinary collection. Um, this is a staple for your kitchen. And I want you to take everything that you think you know about ginger, think sushi and stir fry and turmeric being too much of an Indian spice and take that completely out of your mind. Ginger is, our ginger is amazing in chili, of all things. Amazing, your friends are gonna say, what is in this, it's incredible. Our turmeric, you can have on a simple scrambled eggs, or you can sprinkle salt and pepper on a chicken breast and a little bit of turmeric, you're getting your intake there. The sea salt is beautiful as well. We also decided to equip you with the right tools to enjoy the products, but also to share them. So we have two cookbooks. They're gorgeous. One is Every Day with Ginger and Every Day with Turmeric. And we want you to enjoy these every day. So they're simple swaps to what you already cook. Um, we also inserted a lot of Wakaya imagery in there so you can kind of cook and feel relaxed. <laughs> and um, we created these two delicious 
delicious products, which I'm going to warn you are all addicting. <laughs> but these are great health snacks for your family or you if you're on the go. So we have our ginger, pink Fiji and ginger sea salt caramel popcorn. We're sampling that this evening. Unbelievably amazing. It is all natural, gluten free, non GMO, zero trans fats. We also made these delicious ginger gems, which are bite sized, so you don't need a lot, but you're still getting that healthy fill of your ginger. My, one of my favorites, our spa and personal care collection with all the women who loves all their bath and spa things, <laughs> right? We took our Pink Fiji and Ginger and we actually married a few products. So we have our Pink Fiji and Ginger body scrub. Your shower will sell, smell amazing. It's a great luxurious blend of sugar and sea salt in our ginger. We also have the calcium bentonite um, mineral clay, which is one of my favorites, you can do so much with this in your bath. You can create your own bath, your own clay mask. You can actually sprinkle it into your bath and get that detoxification. It's pretty incredible in this lineup. We also have the ginger body soap, which is one of my favorites because it only has two ingredients. It has 95% of our pink Fiji and ginger and 5% of our sea salt. So if you have any respiratory is issues, you want to take a bath, perfect thing to soak in while you're soaking, then you have that nice detoxification from the sea salt. It's a beautiful combination and definitely a statement piece for your bathroom. We also decided to tap into the DLO that we spoke of earlier. We made a gorgeous DLO SPF sun cream. So for those of you who have children, you don't want them to get sunburned, this is an all-natural SPF. It does have that healing DLO oil in it. On the right, we have a gorgeous shampoo. This is our Pink Fiji and Ginger, which stimulates and re-energizes your scalp as the shampoo. And then we have the conditioner built in. Now, the conditioner is the Delo oil, which actually conditions your hair follicles. So for if you have long hair out there, this is amazing. It really lathers up beautifully, and you get that same uh, Fiji and, uh, Pink Fiji and Ginger smell. And the Delo cream, which I know you will uh, sh surely become addicted to. It's very hydrating. I want to tell you a a little bit goes a long way. So just a little dab, face, hands, it's absolutely beautiful. You'll, you'll feel it working immediately. We also have our amazing Sava collection with the calcium bentonite clay. These two are my favorite. The Daily Detox Clay Mask. You just simply put on your face. It draws out the impurities and the toxins within your skin. 15 to 30 minutes, you take a warm towel, wipe it off, and then you complement complement it with our clay moisturizer. So you're really drawing out the toxin. You're hydrating again. It's a beautiful, beautiful collection. And we have, of course, the Bula bottle, which is delicious, very functional, and I love that you can take it wherever you go and get pure water and the best type of ingredients in it as well. And our essential oils collection, which you will see, we actually do blends of oils. So we have an immunity blend, we have all different type of a digestion, digestion blend, and then we have the very basic ones, peppermint, eucalyptus, frankincense, lavender, beautiful, beautiful oils. and. Really quickly, we'll talk about the wellness landscape. So talk about timing. You are in the perfect time to be in the wellness space. This is a slide that's very important. Wellness is not a passing fad. People are looking at wellness as a lifestyle now. Before, you just looked at it as kind of upkeep. This is now a lifestyle. We're giving you products that is going to grow this industry far beyond $3 trillion. That's where it's currently at. And you look at the four categories that are leading the pack. Beauty and anti-aging. Everyone wants to look pretty and young. Um, healthy eating and weight loss is number two. Preventative health care, which is really what we found founded Wakaya Perfection on, as well as fitness, mind, body. So timing is perfect. This is, we could not be teed up for a better opportunity to, to quadruple that number. And um, this was really exciting for us. In 2012, Oprah Winfrey got a hold of our ginger, and as the O Magazine offices said, she flipped out. She demanded ginger tea on the spot. She scooped it out of a big jar and went crazy. So she actually asked to put our um, launch under press embargo, which means we wouldn't allow any other press to write about it other than Oprah, which was a fabulous thing to happen. So she's a huge fan of Wakaya Perfection, so much so that two 
years later, she selected us again. There's only five other brands in the world that she selected more than once. Um, so she selected us on the beauty side the second time, which was fabulous. And who else loves Wakaya Perfection? Every leading magazine has covered this brand. I can tell you when pitching to editors, they absolutely fall in love with it. Everything from Forbes, Town & Country, Us Magazine, Departures, you name it. Everyone has written about this gorgeous collection. So you already have the power and momentum of this beautiful brand behind you. So I wanted to say, as I said, as we say in Fijian, Vinaka, and hopefully you have a good feeling for the collection and just how powerful and pure the products are that you're going to represent. So, Vinaka, thank you.